It's official, the royal couple is on the move, and just where they might end up has many on the edge of their seats. I think it's a fascinating topic for everyone. Um, we're Canadian, it's part of the Commonwealth. Um, you know, I think it's, it's pretty cool if they want to move to Canada. I'm fully supportive of what they want to do. Today, Buckingham Palace said the pair will be giving up their royal titles and public funding in hopes of living a quieter life in Canada. I think that they found it was pretty complicated to, uh, to try and keep the, uh, that status and live apart from the royal family and do their own thing. Uh, they probably have some plans to, to make their own life, make their own way in the world. Could that life be in B.C.? I doubt they know yet. I, I suspect they're going to come to Vancouver Island and sort of figure things out and then decide from there. The couple spent the holidays in Saanich, just outside of Victoria. Meghan Markle was in Vancouver last week. B.C.'s premier said the province would welcome the two with open arms. I'm as excited as everyone else about uh, uh, Harry and Meghan and little Archie being here in British Columbia. Uh, over the, the holiday break. And if they want to come back and put down roots here, I'm sure I could find something for Harry to do. And the film industry is booming in British Columbia, so I'm sure Megan could get on with uh, one of the great, maybe Riverdale, who knows. One British tabloid even reports they're considering this mansion in Vancouver's Kitsilano. When neighbor Max Lechtman first heard about it, he had to see the house for himself. It was pretty cool. I wonder if there'd like, be a lot of security and stuff, if things would change. Mm -hmm. I just wanted them to be happy, I guess, you know. Yeah. I'm sure it's not easy for them with everything they're going through. Other residents in the neighborhood have mixed opinions. They are uh, very supportive of Canada and they've, they are good role models and they support good foundations. So I'd be happy to see them in the neighborhood. Uh, from a selfish viewpoint, it'll screw up our lives because this is a daily walking point and I don't think it'll be quite the same anymore. The experts say the couple could just as easily end up in Toronto. But for now, eyes will remain on this live action soap opera as the world awaits their next move. John Hernandez, CBC News, Vancouver.